Where's the horse and the rider? Where is the horn that was blown? They have passed like rain on the mountains. Like wind in the meadow. Hello everyone, this is Dudical. We're back with some more Third Age, and let me tell you, I'm very excited about this playthrough because just recently I found out that you can do hot seat campaigns. Yes, a hot seat campaign is when you share one computer, two people play, and you just take turns. Now, the first idea I had when I heard about this, naturally because I have no friends, is that I would play two different factions by myself. And so, without any further ado, I am going to be playing Gondor because I have played Gondor before multiple times. I mean, I think three or four times in the past. And I fail utterly every single time I've played them. Can't tell you why, I just do very badly. I get overrun by Harad and Mordor. I can't seem to make enough progress. I seem to always be in debt. I pretty much just run into debt immediately. But I'm going to be pairing them with Rohan. I will be playing Gondor and Rohan at the same time. This is a very exciting matchup. And ever since I figured out this hot seat, I've been thinking about all different matchups I can do. Like, what if I did Orcs of Gundabad and the Dwarves? How interesting would that be? Go across the whole top of the map and then just go to war with everybody. Or like, Free Peoples and the High Elves. What about that? Right next to each other. What about Harad and Run? And then immediately go to war with Mordor? I mean, the possibilities are truly endless. And uh, I'm very excited about this. I think I'll be playing, because of this, I'll be playing a lot more campaigns. We're going to do a long one. Because I imagine that we're going to get to where we're going pretty quick. Without any further ado, we will be managing all cities. We will not show CPU moves because I think that's a, that's a good way to make the game a little bit more difficult. We will disable console cheats. No battle time limit. We will not be auto-resolving anything and will not be using passwords because uh, I'm playing by myself. No advice, of course. I do medium-medium. Uh, the very hard I don't think makes any difference in terms of their tactics, but it does give them enormous buffs to their resources and production and stuff and when you put that very hard on a campaign map it just gives the AI extra armies which I can't I, I can't accept the Athelian Rangers so sneaky look at them they're hiding oh yeah beautiful okay so here's my plan pairing Rohan with Gondor all right it's a masterwork plan, I'm not gonna lie. My plan is to play defensively as Gondor. While I play defensively, smash Isengard. Right off the bat, send everything I've got to Isengard and try to take the city. Try to knock Isengard out of the game within the first like 20 or 30 turns. During this time, I'm just gonna try to stabilize Gondor. I'm going to send a small force south to make sure none of the Harad cross the river, and everyone else is going to Western Osgiliath, preferably Eastern Osgiliath, because hold it, it's easier to hold. But like I said in the past, it's been a disaster playing as Gondor. I've lost every time, never even gotten close to winning. But I think having Rohan, and actually having a Rohan that backs me up, as opposed to the AI Rohan, which does absolutely sweet fuck all. <laughs> Those fountain guards are so cool. Oh, come on. With that scene right there. White tree. Welcome to Middle Earth. Cool. Alright, let's see what we got here. We have a spy. All right, let's send him across the river pretty much immediately. We have Faramir with one group of Thillian Rangers. That's dangerous. Yes, my lord. We got Boromir with nothing. We got 15,000 gold. We got some Fountain Guard and some dudes. These Axemen of Lasarch, or whatever they're called, are really sweet. 
Man, I can make a diplomat right off the bat. I don't have a diplomat, so I need that. I will take some Pelagrio Marines, some of my favorite troops in the game. God, Gondor just... You know, you'd think that there's just no way that they could do badly. I'm telling you, man. They do. <laughs> they do do badly. Do do. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. I should be ashamed. Land clearance. Alright, uh, town watch. And I'm way over here as well. Land clearance. I need roads, buddy. Alright. Rebel. All I have is this one spy. I need to send him across the river. As soon as possible. I'll keep a small force in both of these cities. But everyone else is going to the front. Like, all three of you guys are definitely going to the front. Let's go to the town. Let's do land clearance for them as well, and then put them on growth. Yes, my lord. With honor! Your orders, my lord. Can they get to there? Yeah, they can. Okay, good. Let's reinforce. My lord. They need more. Alright, yes. that's good for now. Let's send Boromir there as well. Your orders, my lord. It's a little scary having Boromir and Faramir there, but should be okay for, for now, for the time being. Set sail. Ooh, Gondor Militia. Alright, pretty much nobody can train special units right off the bat. Except the Pelagrim Marines, who are- they're good for the rest of the game. Well, I can go for Assassins right off the bat. Look at this, it's just so- they're so developed. 3500 for that. Alright, yeah, I'll get rid of... Who am I building? I need to go for mines. Anywhere that can build mines needs to build mines. Mines or roads. We can worry about farms later. That's expensive though. And that's a paved road. They already have some roads. But no right. <laughs> <coughs> I'm sorry about that everyone. Whew. What will the barracks give? Okay, Gondor infantry and such. Alright. I'd say that looks just about good. Oh, we've got like a little Gondor fort up there. That's cool. Yes, my lord. Alright. And we go right to Rohan. Perfect. Beautiful. Look at this. Your orders, my lord. Now, Rohan has very large territories. Yes, my lord. Actually, quite similar to Gondor. I'm going to go through and make sure that all their places get mines, if they can. What's standing stones? Culture, okay. Ooh, ballista towers for Helm's Deep. No. Nah. Wow, no mines anywhere, huh? Alright, in that case we're gonna go roads. Everyone gets roads. Yeah, okay, roads for everyone. Perfect. And then you are gonna take him, and you're gonna go start building. Oh, wait, do I have a spy? I do have a spy. Perfect. You are gonna go keep an eye on Isengard, please. Yes, my lord. Yes. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. Sorry about that, everyone. I think I'm getting sick. Your best shot. Your orders. All right, we're sending everybody Continue to the Foldberg. Your orders, my lord. For sure. Well, my lord. most people to the Foldberg. 
As you wish. Almost everybody. Yes, my lord. Orders. Your orders, my lord. Your will, my lord. Yes, my lord. I have too many generals. What is Rohan Your thinking with all these generals? Orders. Let's put them on growth. In the coming turns, most of my territories will be put on growth. Orders. By your command, we'll make camp here. Yes, my lord. My lord. Is there a general here? Yeah. Put a watchtower there, please. Watchtower. All right, cool. Um, if you've never seen me play before, you're going to see me build an inordinate amount of watchtowers. Uh, a ridiculous amount. I believe in watchtowers. I believe that they're absolutely essential. Being able to see all of your territory at all times. That's a good def that's a good dude right there. All right, I will take that ASAP. And what do I get for it? Some of the best units available. Perfect. Palantir. Oh, I have a Palantir Minas Tirith, huh? Okay, I think I press F3 to use it. No? Okay. F1 is Palantir. Huh. I don't know how that works. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. How far can you guys reach? Yes, oh, Barry. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. But two generals and these guys can probably take it. Diplomat. All right. Well, you're obviously gonna go right to Rohan, and then Spy will go across the river and north. You're gonna keep an eye on them for pretty much the rest of the game. I need those Pelgrim Marines up here. Your orders, my lord. Orders. All right. I need watchtowers. Erecting a watchtower. Yes. We have marched our limit, my lord. Continuing tomorrow. Erecting a watchtower. Orders. Erecting a watchtower. By your command, my lord orders. Yes, my lord. <laughs> there is no glory like in hiding like this, my lord. Almost comical to have so many over the land, um, my lord. so many generals. We have marched our limit, erecting a watchtower. This guy's pretty cool. He's got a cool picture. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. Orders. My lord. We have marched our limit. Your will, my lord. As you wish. Ooh, they're not happy. Uh, oh, yeah, they're mega, super, ultra unhappy. Oh. Why are they so unhappy? Let's, let's ask them. Let's show my settlement deeps. Cultural unrest, really? Followers of Melkor. There's a few of them there. That's unfortunate. My lord. Yes. Oh, he wasn't a general. Crap. <laughs> Grab the wrong guy. This tower will keep vigil. Your will, my lord. Yes, my lord. Is this still my territory? This yeah, it is. We'll put a tower there. Over the lands. We can go That's no right. Towers lord. everywhere. You know, this is probably why I'm always broke. I have another one. Another palantir in Edoras. Ooh, minus two thousand. Minus two, uh, nine thousand is what that said. Your That's pretty orders, brutal. My lord. With honor, this tower will keep vigil over the lands. Orders. By your command. Erecting a watchtower. Yes. 
orders. Yes. Yes, my lord. With honor. This tower will keep vigil over the land. Your orders, my lord. With honor. This tower will keep vigil over the land. There are many differences our people. My lord. Spy. Where up there, please? Quietly. Approaching quietly. I shall continue to. <laughs> now they will get summoned units. By your command. Sorry for sniffling, everybody. They will certainly get summoned units. Uh, if I attack them. We're ready to ambush the enemy. So I definitely need to be ready for it. We have marched our limit. Yes, my lord. With honor. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. This guy's just yes. gonna be my watchtower dude we can go no back further, here. My lord. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. You're actually gonna go honor. there and build one there. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. Yes. Your orders, my lord. With honor, making camp here. Yes, my lord. Your orders, my lord. And this area is not mine. Yeah, definitely axemen. That's what I need. All right. As you can see, spent a couple thousand gold in the last two turns on watchtowers. But it's a one-time investment. There's no upkeep or anything. Just 200 gold per tower. He's betrothed, sure. Why not? Alright, let's see where this is. Right there, okay. Yes, my lord. Yes. Making camp here. We hmm. shall continue tomorrow. My lord. Approaching quietly. Impossible, my lord. Orders. Hey, you don't tell As me what's wait. impossible. Your orders, my lord. This tower will keep vigil over the my lord. Yes. We'll make camp here. Not possible. We can't get there. Your will, my lord. As you wish. Orders. As you wish. Erecting a watchtower. Yes. Continuing tomorrow. Orders. Yes, my lord. With honor, we can go no further, my okay, lord. Take this cavalry with yes. you. We shall continue tomorrow, my lord. Orders. By your command. Erecting a watchtower. As you wish. Orders. As you wish. I'll send these three armies west. Orders. Let's go look for more Erecting a watch places tower. to put watchtowers. <laughs> I'm just trying to look for more places to look for watchtowers. As many as humanly possible. Ah, oh, no money. Damn. There you go. Keep him safe. Okay. Oh, wait. No. Where's my diplomat? Your orders, without question. Stop. Okay, cool. Ooh, erect or er, orec is uh, they're not happy. They're like, what the hell, man? We're empty now. There's nobody here. Do these guys have a, a diplomat? No, they don't. But they had the ability to make one right off the bat. That's amazing. That's so strong to be able to do that. I'm only saying that because some of the other, some of the evil factions can't do that. Yes, my lord. With honor, this tower will keep vigil over the lands. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. With honor, this tower will keep vigil over my lord. As you wish. Orders. 
Erecting a watchtower. Your orders, my lord. My lord. My lord. Approaching quietly. Yes, my lord. No money for any more watchtowers at this point. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. Yeah. Orders. Your will, my lord. As you wish. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. We're combining forces. Making camp here. Your orders, my lord. My lord. I don't need anybody in this fort. You can go to the full bird. We'll make camp here. Your you can will, also go. Yes, my lord. Cool. New units. Not a lot of opportunity to increase income, though. As opposed to, like, when, for example, the Misty Mountains, every one of your cities has the ability to build mines, and so you end up making just insane money. Yep, it'll say it'll take a decade. Oh. Yeah, we got riding there. That's no good. Orders. By your command. Yeah. Now let's put them on growth. My lord. Yes. We have marched our limit. Erecting a watchtower. Continue. Your orders, my lord. Orders. As you wish. Put two more watchtowers there. Looking good. These will add just a little bit more money. <laughs> Damn. My lord. Approaching Minas Morgul reached. You have reached Minas Morgul, also known by its earlier name of Minas Ethyl. Sometimes called the Dread City or the Tower of Sorcery, it was originally built by Isildur during Sauron until Sauron returned after escaping Numenor's destruction, and his forces took Minas Ethyl by force. It's a hell of a um, a fortress. Like they say, he took it by force. It must have been an extreme amount of force. Orcs. My lord. My lord. Terrifying. My lord. Yes. Yes, my lord. To battle. We shall prevail. Let's just maintain yes. for now. Yeah. We can wait one more turn for the Pelagrius to catch up. Got 13 more turns for that. And I'm gonna get free units, which is always great. Let's put everybody on basically auto manage growth it will decrease our tax money significantly but I think it'll be good in the long run all right they're all on growth Except Minas Tirith, it does not need it. <laughs> there, that's a castle, technically. All right, and I still have these two down here. Cool. Lord, this is a perfect position to ambush. Yep, 10 years, military port. Minus Morgo reached as well. Because my ally got there. Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. Yes, stopping here. My lord. Approaching quietly. Approaching quietly. Approaching quietly. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. 
This tower will keep vigil over the lands. With honor. Your orders, my lord. My lord. Yes. Yes, my lord. That watch tower yeah, it is. Okay. With honor. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. Yes. We shall continue tomorrow. Growth as well. Growth as well. Edoras doesn't need it because it's a gigantic city. It's a castle, so it doesn't matter. That's a castle, doesn't matter. Growth already. That's it. Building up a little army, it's almost all cavalry though, so it's sort of useless. You know, in in a siege battle. My lord. Your orders, my lord. Orders. My lord. Your will, my lord. By your command. Orders. As you wish. Yes, my lord. My lord. Yes. Your will, my lord. By your command. Merging up by your command. March to exhaustion, continuing later. <laughs> your orders, my lord. Alright, great. Looking good. Uh, we don't need any more generals. Both of these countries have too many already. My lord. As you wish, we'll make camp here. My lord. Approaching quite Rebel Mordor. Cannot withdraw. Mm, shit. That's so many bandits. We need to scatter them. All right. I didn't lose my general at least. Orders. Oh, now I know there's some bandits there. Yes, my lord. Yes. With honor. This tower will keep vigil over the land, my lord. Uh, that's uh, that upsets me. There's a little darkness there still. Orders. Yes, my lord. As you wish. Your orders, my lord. Send an emissary to Mordor. Can I get there in five turns with this guy? As you wish. One, two, Tomorrow's three, four, five. I don't think so, man. I shall continue tomorrow. Tomorrow's journey planned out. I shall continue tomorrow. Stopping here. <laughs> yeah, I forgot to talk to Greetings, my Gondor allies. Ally. Yes, my lord. Orders. Yes, my lord. With my lord. As you wish. Your will, my lord. By your command. 
Oh yeah. This is the plan. We're gonna smash, absolutely smash Isengard. It took South Tharbad. I'm not gonna get much further than that. I'm gonna see to it. It's all cavalry though. I guess I can send them in the front when I knock the front door down. I'm gonna send a whole bunch of generals through. <laughs> Time to get rid of these guys. I'm gonna send these three guys through the through the breach. Egbert, Alaric, and Eomund. They're all promising commanders and they're all young. Time to prove yourselves. My lord. We can go no further Once these two units of Axemen go, once they get there, we're attacking. Your orders, my lord. Yes. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. We can probably build no one over there too, buddy. Sweet, look at this. I can see my whole territory now. Yes, my lord. With honor, this tower will keep vigil over the lands. Your orders, my lord. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. Yes, as you wish. Joining. All right, let's save. Let's call this Gondor and Rohan. Safe. Beautiful. I think this is going to be a brilliant alliance. I can't see how this couldn't work. <laughs> Famous last words. <laughs> I've gotten into so many... Oh, they're forcing my hand, huh? If only I had one more turn, I could get the allies there. It's alright. But... I've gone into so many Total War campaigns with so much confidence and then lost off like just so badly. Just complete, utter, utter defeat. So hopefully that doesn't happen this time. <laughs> it might though. Oh yeah. Alright. Let's line up these Larchies. These Larchy Larts. Put these archers behind them. And since I have two units of Cav, let's put them on the flanks. Again, both of them being um, generals, I might as well make them prove themselves. Is that their whole army right there? Everyone all at once. Mad rushing horde. That's what I like to see. They have some missile troops, but they're not... It doesn't seem like they're gonna hang back and shoot at all. Oh, they're probably like... Javelin guys. This is the general from Lachmont. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. The enemy general abandons his men. Only half the enemy force remains. Oh yeah. Definitely abusing this charge mechanic against uh, bandits. Yeah, you better believe it. 21 lost. Beautiful. That's the kind of result you need against bandits. Because they're so meaningless. Like, you can kill any amount of bandits and not really make much of a... You couldn't, you know, not really make what you could call progress. Another general? I just don't need him, man. I got so many already. Gondor Cav at my capital. Now, if I was more intelligent, I would have, like, built something to make that little thing there more profitable, where I just got some units for free. But hey. It is what it is.
I am the largest faction. That's right. My lord. Erecting a watchtower. Yes, my lord. With honor. This tower will keep vigil over the orders. My lord. Erecting a watchtower. By your command. Erecting a watchtower. We have marked your orders, my lord. This tower will keep vigil over the land. Yes, my lord. Alright, and these forces that are like 50% generals, they're gonna go yes, that direction. Yes. Always happy to deal with you, trusted friends. So we're already ally, we already have all that stuff. Let's do those. And I guess that's it. Good day to you. Ederus reached. Without question. Ederus is a nice spot. I'm gonna see if I can <laughs> get uh, trade rights with Tomorrow's journey these guys. I'm gonna go up I this way. Free peoples, elves, dwarves, and then come over to Gunda, and then Sylvan, like that. It's gonna be a very long process, but Stopping that's what diplomats here. do. My spy, however, is there anything useful you can do? The dead marshes. Oh man. You have reached the Dead Marshes, where several battles were fought, most notably the Battle of Daggerlad at the end of the Second Age, when the Last Alliance met the forces of Mordor of many casualties amongst elves, men, orcs on both sides. Hey, where's the dwarves? Oh, they didn't fight. Through the years, the marshland began to encroach upon parts of the battlefield and engulf the dead that lay there. Approaching oh man. Quietly. Approaching quietly. Approaching no new missions, but tomorrow's journey. Yeah, you know, maybe I should have waited a little while for this, but that's all right. I gotta go take. What's this one called? My lord. Care Andrews or something like that. Oh yeah, let's get these cav south. As you wish, orders. Yes. Erecting a watchtower by your command. Those cavalry will join up with this guy. They'll go to here, and we'll send an army out to deal with those rebels. Ships ready. I'm not really sure what to do with these. Is there? A, there is, and you have to take a ship there. Ooh, so there's more Harad there than I like. Maybe I should try to take this island city. Put a bunch of watchtowers on it. <laughs> Yeah, whatever. I'm not trying to fight a naval war. I mean, I suppose if I had to, I would. My lord. Your lord. Yes, my lord. Your orders, my lord. Orders. Yeah, they're, they're gonna rebel if I do that. Hiding from the enemy. Yes, my lord. Your All orders, right. my lord. Larchi, you stay there. Yes, my lord. You guys gotta go to Oskilia. Making camp here. Your orders, my lord. There is no glory in hiding like this, my lord. Yes, my lord. My lord. By your command. I'm gonna stick you. Yeah, we'll see. Now, if I stick you first. Money, Your I'm starting to notice, is going to be a problem. Yep. Until we meet again. Address reached. Dead March is reached. Don't need more generals. Well, I am about to lose a bunch of generals. Mysterious reached. And I made 500. Yes, my lord. Who's that? It's my diplomat. Never gonna get there. So far away. There's just no way.
Yeah, I think that I should send him on the same mission that I was sending the Gondor guy on. My lord. Where's my spy? There he is. Approaching quietly. Cool. Approaching quietly. Your orders, my lord. Yes. With things this bad, they can only improve. Your orders, my lord. I will speak your horrid tongue if I must. Hmm. Did they join that already? I mean, didn't I have two units of axemen right around here? Did they join this yes, group already? Your orders, my Can't lord. Can't remember. Yes. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. Yes, my lord. Orders. Your orders, my lord. It's just three more units. And a mega general. I have my faction leader here. Already. Yes, my lord. Your will, my lord. Orders. Your orders, my lord. As you wish. Yes, my lord. Your orders, my lord. Yes. Making camp here. Yes, my lord. With honor, we shall continue tomorrow. When you have so many cities, it becomes difficult to decide who gets who gets your financial commitment. Minas Tirith, pretty legendary city. I don't need more generals. Leave me alone. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. Yes. We can go no further, my lord. Your orders, my lord. Nope, you still can't leave. Yes, my lord. Orders. As you wish. Orders, my lord. By your command, my lord. The combining forces. We have marched our limit. Your orders, my lord. Orders. As you wish. Ooh. Not doing particularly financially well for anybody. My lord, without question, tomorrow's journey planned out. More roads. Yes, my lord. That's good. Yes. As you command, we shall prevail. Oh yeah, I like ladders. Yes. And they got a unit of troops. That they got a bunch of troops. Damn. That's okay though. I think I'll handle it. Guys, just save their money and wait for communal farming. Yeah, I, I need farming. I think. Or maybe we should just be building troops. I have one full stack army already. Yeah, I'll save my money. We're ready to ambush the enemy. Oh, no more troops, Your please. Orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. Your orders, my lord. To battle! We shall prevail! 
Yes. I'll probably just starve them out or force them to attack me. My lord. Approaching quietly, my lord. Your orders. As you wish. Tomorrow's journey planned out. Ooh, massive debt. Orders. My lord. Yes, my your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. Yes. Right, I'm gonna send all the forces I can spare from here to go attack that city. Oh, and let's see if I can use the Palantir. Yep, I can. Uh, accept to view anywhere, so I'll accept. Where is this? this is up the main river. Uh, it's not even revealing anything. <laughs> it's not even revealing the land. I actually don't see anything. Okay. Cool, I guess. As you wish. You are weaker than I. Your orders, my lord. Orders. Yes, my lord. Orders. Orders. Assembling a praise our banners. Let's slaughter these guys. Our forces into battle, my lord. Yeah, somehow I'm playing Gondor and I've the majority of my forces are uh cavalry. They're just gonna run off the map. Computer does that sometimes. Oh yeah. We're under attack. We're not. They are. is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. The enemy 
general. We've captured the enemy's general. Excellent. That'll teach the cowardly dog to turn tail and run. The enemy are badly blown. The enemy army flees the field. Pursue and run them down. The victory we oh, yeah. have won here today. That's right, 100%. Oh, we captured 384. We captured almost half their army. Wait. I don't know. My math's not great. That might have been more than half. Your enemies lie defeated. You know, that's what I like. By your command. We have marched our Ooh, limit. Going even more into debt. I don't like having Boromir and Faramir there. I'm afraid that they're going to march a giant army out and kill my two favorite heroes over here. Denethor is worthless. Sacrifice him as soon as possible. <laughs> They'll hold out for nine turns. I'm gonna stick you. I have a feeling they're going for this. Blade. My lord. Yes. I shall continue tomorrow. My lord. Approaching quietly. Your will, my lord. Yes, my lord. As you wish. We'll make camp here. Your will, my lord. Your orders, my lord. Ooh, we got 1900 over here. Oh, yeah, I saved up a turn. I forgot about that. Let's go for land clearance over there as well. Yes, my lord. Perfect, yes. this guy's just enough money to build another watchtower. <laughs> hey, don't call my ambushes cowardly, man. God. I'm your king. Be respectful. Yeah, this guy. I don't know, should I just attack? No more waiting around. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Of the 20 units here, I only have seven infantry, and one, two, three, three of them are archers. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to have archers push the catapult, or I mean, push the, uh, the battering ram. <laughs> no, this guy's on the battering ram for sure. Well, there's nothing wrong with giving it another turn. Approaching the siege. I shall They'll be uh, more injured. And if they sally forth, they will get slaughtered. Your will, my lord. Nothing to worry about. Maybe I should cancel that land clearance and build a unit of troops here. Just to make sure that, like, actually, I'll just have the king yes, run away. Yeah. Okay, go to Helm's Deep. Makes more sense. And where is my diplomat? Lord, I already told him I moved in. And send spy, an I already moved that. Alright. Yeah, everyone's getting wives. Send emissary to Isengard. Yes, my lord. Okay. As you wish. Um. Approaching their dignitary. Tomorrow's yeah. journey planned out. Let's just Stopping go there. Here. Yes, my lord. Is that what you want? Mm, it's a relief force coming to try to break out the siege of Isengard. Don't like that. Your orders, my lord. Cairn Andros. It's a fortress. 
Yes, my lord. My lord. Your orders, my lord. Orders. Yes, my lord. My lord. Yes. Your orders, my lord. Orders. Yes, my lord. Yes. All right, you guys are going to take that city. <laughs> I hope they don't have any walls. You should be okay. Problem. We'll see. Orders. As you wish. Yes, my lord. Making camp here. Orders. By your command. March to exhaustion, continuing later. All right. I ain't got no money, but nobody cares. Got a little bit of money over here. Yeah, they're not down very much. Down from 250 to 245. Alright. Time to Lord. Your orders. just make this happen. Without question. Stopping here. Yes, my lord. Your orders, my lord. Yes. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. With honor. And this is my border, right? Like, I don't, my land doesn't go across the water right making camp here I presume it doesn't we shall continue tomorrow your will my lord as you wish ooh Edoras is empty they're not like hiding troops or anything right I always assume they're doing something sneaky the computer All right, let's make this happen. As you come on. Two batting rams and four ladders. Oof, 2,100 units from Saruman. Muster your courage, men. We march into battle. I have almost entirely cavalry. Like, two-thirds of my army is cavalry. This might be a disaster. It's gonna be like another five or six turns to try to starve them out, though. Start deployment. Alright, everyone drop your stuff, because just generally speaking, I don't like how the game organizes this. The, mo the most useless troops, of course, will take the battering ram. The people who are semi useful, useful will take ladders. I actually do wish some of these guys were infantry and not all cavalry. I have Royal Guardian, I'm not throwing them away. Everyone else though can go right into the breach. Alright. Let's put people a little closer. Archers. 
We just double time up there. I don't think they have any ranged units. That's convenient. Are we though? I think they're under attacking me. Our men have reached the gate with a battering ram. Our men have reached the walls with their ladders. Done well. The gates have fallen. are now in place. Walls are no match for the valor and force of our arms. Alright, you put all these crap troops up here at the front. I'm okay with that. I'm in no rush. Those guys just finished getting up the wall. Excellent. I'm gonna expend the rest of my arrows. And I'm gonna send one general and the majority of my cav through, half my cav, and then send the other three generals and the other half of the cav. But you guys are missile cav. All right, well, guess what? You're gonna do some melee. Sorry. All right, that's it for that. The archers can go back and hang out with the king. You and you. Going right through the breach with you three. Our soldiers have proved their worth today. The enemy's walls belong to us now. Battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Oh, yeah, look at that. I ran through them and then I come in with the other guys from the other side. You guys are having trouble getting off the wall, apparently. Four general units there. Don't let them join up with the rest of the units. Go, kill you, Snaga. It's because some of them are still up on the wall, so the game's kind of confused. It's like, what are you talking about? The horses can't get up there? That's what I was thinking. Horses can't go on the walls. Crazy human. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. These guys are the problem.
Klansmen. You can't count on them. Never count on Klansmen. Look at that. I kept, uh... I can't remember his name. That guy's gambling. I always think that he's Theo did, but he's not. Now, should I just attack them from all sides? There's multiple groups of elite troops with phalanx-capable Urukai and... Oh, God. And there's some guards of Orthanc in there. I could lose my whole army attacking this right here. I could. And Sauron's in there. Okay, I think I should bring him in. Oh, wow. Greatly increases combat effectiveness. they done here? They sent their guards of Orthanc around the back. Hmm. Now I'm not sending in these two kings, or these two, the king and the uh, other general, but I will have them nearby to use their abilities. Alright, scouts, you go tie up these guards of Orthanc. Make sure Sauron can't help. Not for at least a little while. I think victory seems certain. Only a fool could lose this battle. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Yeah, you definitely need to go attack them. 
Can you help? And this mass right here is a, is a real problem. I just lost gambling. Oh no, Aelmund. Okay, never mind. He wasn't important. The battle is very much in but I will lose gambling if I'm not careful. Alright, you have to go around and hit these four things from the back. Second Rohan general going down. I only consider this a loss if I lose gambling. Where is he? There he is. Or this guy, because he's actually the faction leader. No other losses would matter. Where is Sauron? The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Good, I'm glad he's back there. This is incredibly bloody here. I completely forgot about these militia. Oh my god. Excellent. The enemy, but no less dead for that. We must press our advantage. The battle is very much in our favor. I can't believe I forgot about these militia. <laughs> oh man, I let all my other troops die down to the man. Okay, let's take this whole group out of the fight permanently. As well as both my generals, both my important generals, I mean. Our men have taken control of the castle. Still have one general in there. Yes. Oh yeah. Heavy losses, heavy losses, but it's all right. I think it's totally worth it. This early in the game, I think it's not even turn 10. Maybe it's not even turn to 15. And I took Isengard, and Isengard will not be taking it back. Casualties inflicted. 198, those guys. Bodyguard, bodyguard, bodyguard. Mm. Horse archers, okay. Archers, archers. Beautiful. Absolutely stunning. Ah, <laughs> uh, two generals go down. An honorable, glorious victory. I completely agree. Noble conquest. Uh, I need the money. I, I should sack it, I think. I like exterminating, especially on a place like this, where it's going to take a long time for them to switch over to my culture. But I'll sack it, because it still kill a third of the population. And I get a lot more money. And I need to get rid of whatever shrines they have. Oh, 
Oh, they don't have any Melkor shrines. Alright. They do have a mining network though there. That's a lot of money. I should start saving up for that after this built is built. Because I need to switch over their population to my own. Who can I retrain? Alright, we'll do some scouts. And it's a fortress. It's a castle, I mean. Beautiful. And, and do we recover much? Not not very much, but my lord still. Yes, my lord. Enemy army routes. Noble death. Eumund. And Egbert. Of the six generals that I brought, two died. But the remaining two certainly got a lot of experience. Marks of war, brave, talent for command. He's 22. This guy's going to go far. Fulgrim. Ho ho. Space Marine in our midst. And Alaric. He's old in one command. He's going to... He's not going to be a promising commander. Maybe promising defender. He's going to be hanging out in this uh, in Isengard for the rest of the game, most likely. I'll just have him sit there to, to maintain loyalty and uh, order. Public order. Heavy losses on both sides. They lost Saruman. And that is where I'm going to call it for you guys today. This is the end of the first episode. I absolutely love this. I love playing more than one faction. I'm so happy I was able to find this. Maybe in the future I'll even do a game where I play every single nation in the entire game at the same time against myself. Just so that I can really be a hateful masochist. <laughs> Well, thank you all so much for watching. Please check out the next video. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any. Take care. Bye-bye.